Hello and welcome to our channel. Now in this video, we will tell you how the cast of 1995 heat has changed. I'll show you what they were like back then in 1995 and now in 2022 how they've changed compared to when they were in this movie. Robert De Niro in the movie he plays Neil McCauley. In 1995, he was 52 years old and now he's 79 years old. No, it's because you were fine. I got zero going the other way, a double blank and all of a sudden... Someone like you comes along. That Francis wanted him, I, I thought of the uh, sunny part, I liked that too, and I even read for it for Francis, but, but he also wanted Jimmy Kahn for that, the way I understand. Al Pacino, in the movie, he plays Lieutenant Vincent Hanna. In 1995, he was 55 years old, and now he's 82 years old. You're wasting my motherfucking time. Vincent, man, look. fall in love. Come on. Did you fall in love last night? You went off somewhere? This. Just tell me that. I'll, I'll settle for it. You know what I mean? I'll buy it. For the reasons I can't really remember. What could have been the reason well, for I that? I couldn't go because I was uh, on stage in Boston. John Voight in the movie he plays Nate. In 1995, he was 57 years old and now he's 83 years old. Flying's in the air now. We run out of time. The driver's end, I still can't find nobody, so that's in the trust. One other thing. I give him credit for my career as an actor. I used to imitate Sid Caesar doing the, the German, his German professor, you know. Val Kilmer, in the movie, he plays Chris Sheerless. In 1995, he was 36 years old, and now he's 62 years old. The bank is worth the risk. I need it, brother. You should stay and take it down. That's where I come out. I asked the captain if the dear one of the only man that did but fair. Diane Verona in the film she plays Justin. In 1995, she was 43 years old and now she's 70 years old. The rest is the mess you leave as you pass through. I don't understand is why I can't cut loose of you. I know that there was something beyond that star, something beyond, but I just wanted it to, to, to help me without knowing what, it, what, I, what I was asking, you know. Tom Sizemore, in the movie, he plays Michael Cerrito. In 1995, he was 34 years old, and now he's 60 years old. I can't be who I'm supposed to be as a man, as a father, as a friend, as a son, if I'm intoxicated. I just can't. Ashley Judd in the movie she plays Charlene Shearless. In 1995, she was 27 years old and now she's 54 years old. Guys, he's nobody. I know who he is. Who is he? He's nobody. Neil. Listen, he's a, you've... he's a legit liquor wholesale sailor from Las Vegas, Alan Marciano. Chris is going to straighten it up with you. It's too late. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. Shut up! I appreciate so deeply and really want to start by thanking everyone for their, for their outpouring of love and condolences. Amy Brenneman in the movie she plays Edie. In 1995, she was 31 years old and now she is 58 years old. What area is that? Graphic design. I do, um letterheads and logotypes at night and stores a day job till I get enough going. And I'm doing whatever I can to find her. So I think most parents will relate to that um, somehow, even though she does sort of go into the dark side. Wes Duty in the movie he plays Casals. In 1995, he was 48 years old and now he's 74 years old. Well, after that he's gone. Bye bye. Bang. Something that I can be a little more uh, comfortable with in that um, uh, physical makeup in terms of tongue, mouth, all of that uh, that is involved in speaking. McKelty Williamson in the movie he plays Drucker. In 1995, he was 38 years old and now he's 65 years old. Because he becomes an orphan when you go to prison as an accessory because 
You got no living parents to take it, so he ends up state-raised in foster homes, juvenile facilities. Harry Miller's our producer, so they kind of shape the way the show looks. Yeah. You know, and then Arthur Fournier over there, he, he edits and puts the things together, and that's why they all hum like they do. Ted Levine in the movie he plays Bosco. In 1995, he was 38 years old, and now he's 65 years old. What the hell is going on? Well, that's what we're trying to figure out. We thought we had it. Thought we had it. Talk a little bit more about the human side of him. So I checked out the transgender idea, you know, of, uh, I went to a club in Chicago called La Baton where... Thanks for watching the whole video. If you like this video, please share it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us in producing the next videos.